What's up guys, Andrews here with another weekly update or a very short weekly update since there really hasn't been much to talk about in the game for the past week or so until maybe next week we'll have a bigger update. So this week no real maintenance, nothing really updated except the Pearl Shop but nothing really crazy to talk about there and the new event called the Gold Rush 2. It's basically just an AFK event, just be online for 5 hours and you'll get some goodies and some seals to then uh, exchange for a Shakatu luxury box. Uh, that's pretty much it on that. Last week we did get the blue uh, manos or the blue mastery life skill clothes and tools so that's a good option if you can't afford to get the manos clothes or the manos accessories although I think I think the optimal choice right now would be to get uh, Tri or Ted green accessories, Tri blue armor for the life skills that you mostly use, and uh, either try and get the Manos tools or the Ted green tools if you really can't afford to get any of the Manos tools whatsoever. And that's pretty much it in terms of that. Uh, nothing really looking like we're going to get the Great Ocean update. I've been prepping for that for quite a while now, for a few weeks. And there's not much else to do. So I'm now on my EU account prepping there. And kind of shifting my my guild to be more ocean focused in the future. So if you are on EU and you're looking to kind of uh, do some ocean content once this comes out let me know in the comments or just I'll have the discord link so you can check it out there there is also an indication that we're probably not going to get the ocean expansion probably next week or the week after because the reason is that we haven't really received the remastered UI update yet and so this is the remastered UI that's on test server I'll make a video separately this week about it so you guys can see what I'm talking about but basically it's a whole new UI that's supposed to also help with the uh controller from consoles and uh, make it more intuitive it looks okay in my opinion it's um it has some tweaking to do because a lot of the uh, space is wasted in some of the ui elements but that's how it goes with these kind of things um but overall it's a good change but we don't have it Corey got it a few weeks before the great ocean expansion came out and the great ocean expansion reuses that remastered ui so if we don't have the ui there's no way we're getting the Great Ocean expansion yet. What does that mean? Uh, well, summer's ending, so this was supposed to be the summer update, but we have to remember that this is the summer update for Korea. Korea got it in the summer. Doesn't necessarily mean we'll get it at the same time. Uh, we're going back to pre-global update days where we've gotten used to some content being released at the same time, but back in the old days, you had to wait nine months to get content. And uh, this Life Skull Mastery is one ex prime example of it, it's almost been a year since Korea got it and we finally just received it a, few, a couple of weeks ago. So that's how it goes. I think hopefully by the end of October, we should be seeing uh, the Great Ocean expansion because in November, they usually have a new region or a new class being released. And those are usually now global updates. So global releases. So if November is going to be a sort of new class or new region, um, I would imagine by October, we'll get the Great Ocean update. That doesn't mean that you have time. If you had no idea that you could actually start prepping for the Great Ocean expansion that you have time now to start doing that so i made a little like cheat sheet for you guys uh, of what you can gather right now and what you should have as before the ocean expansion drops so the main thing is you should really have an a furious sailboat or an inferior frigate one of those doesn't matter really which one you get if you're making a frigate just make it it's fine after that you can enhance these sailboats and frigates into enhanced versions of them once the ocean expansion comes out it, all it changes is the cannon is no longer manual fire it's automatic fire through the click of a button really nice change but everything else stays the same this will allow you to do the dailies for sailing uh, much much quicker so what the materials you need for that would be 250 standardized timber square 200 steel 500 pine plywood 100 flax fabric 30 hard pillar and for the sailboat specifically you'll need 10 ultimate armor reform stones and for the frigate 10 ultimate weapon reform stones so that's really easy to get it's not that much stuff that you need to get the hardest thing would be maybe the hard pillars and the standardized timber squares but if you've been making a frigate or sailboat you probably have some left over and they're not that hard to get nowadays uh, with the gathering mastery since a lot of logs are going up in the, in the market now now for the trader and the destroyer which are the uh, i guess tier four versions of the ships now 
um, you need a lot of stuff that is also gated by dailies and the new ocean expansion update but there are a couple things that you can get right now and those are saps and ingots and some my uh, byproducts from gathering so 10,000 white cedar sap 10,000 zinc ingot 10,000 red tree lump 10,000 old tree bark 10,000 acacia sap and 10,000 elder tree sap most of this stuff is on the market so you can just buy it um, I would suggest if the zinc ingots or some of the more expensive stuff you can try and gather yourself since you have time the ocean expansion is probably not coming out next week so you have a f at least a, a few weeks to to get all this stuff so don't rush but make sure you have all this stuff before the expansion comes out to give you a little bit of a boost as you start making your way through the dailies because there are a lot of things that you're gonna have to do every day to try and get those upgrades uh, in a timely manner and having these items already set up will be very beneficial to you and it, that's pretty much it guys let me know what you guys thought about this week's update last week's uh, blue manos uh, uh, blue life skill mastery update are you having luck are you one of those people that are enhancing blue accessories tried that not for me let me tell you really bad luck on my side but that's how it goes with enhancing with me and uh, if you have any questions whatsoever you know just leave them in the comments i'll give you my discord link for my guild so you can check that out and message me there if you want you can dm me directly as well and as always if you haven't already please like and sub every sub counts as we continue to grow and as always thanks for watching guys thanks for listening i'll see you all in the next one take care